What if I told you that you can try almost any Hugging Face models inside VS Code and all you need just Hugging Face provider for GitHub Copilot? So if you want to supercharge your GitHub Copilot chat, then watch this video till the end. To get started, simply open VS Code, then inside the VS Code click the extension icon, it's right here at the left. Then in the extension search, write Hugging Face. It is a new extension from Hugging Face. It's called Hugging Face Provider for GitHub Copilot Chat. Click on it and then click Install button. Make sure you're using the latest version of VS Code because extension doesn't support old version of VS Code. So if you are using the old version, you will see this error message. And in this instance, you have to install new VS Code, simply download it from official website, and then install the extension. You also would need Copilot Chat extension. If you don't have it yet, please install it at the same time. I already have it, so I don't have to install it. Okay, let's try to open a file. It could be any file inside your project. And let's check if our extension is working. Simply open a new chat. Keep in mind, it should be GitHub Copilot chat. Like I said, if you don't have this extension yet, please set up it. You can use GitHub Copilot for free. Once you set up your Copilot, then let's start the chat. Click on the model dropdown, then click at the manage model link. In the search, write hugging face, and then select it from the dropdown. After that, go to the Hugging Face website. If you don't have account there yet, please create one. And then you need to request access token. Under your profile, click at the top right icon. And then from the drop down, select access token. Generate your access token. And then copy and paste it inside VS Code. Okay. And now you can see all the available models from Hugging Face. You can select any specific one, or you can select them all. It is more than 170 models. In the list, almost all open source models available. There is a DeepSeq, Quen, GPT, OOS, and so on. So now, instead of just using close model that available in Copilot, you can use all these open source models from Hugging Face. Let's check if my extension is working. I'm going to try a Quen model and let's see if it knows the code base. I change the mode from agent to ask because I don't want it to make any change to my code base. So I write my simple prompt. I will ask the model to tell me what it's know about my code base. And it seems it generated a proper answer. So yes, it's a Next.js project. Yes, it's host and Firebase. So everything is correct. Okay, let's try to make sure that the model is really a Quen model. I'm going to ask the model, what model are you? And here we go. This is the answer. As you can see, it's a Quen model. So with this extension, you will be able to try almost every open source model that available on Hugging Face. Keep in mind that models run not locally. All the models running on the cloud. Under the free account, you have limited amount of credits. So it will be enough for some small experiments. But if you want to really use the models, you have to purchase Hugging Face Pro account. Or you can select the option pay as you go on the Hugging Face website. And that's probably it. Uh, please give it a shot and share with me your feedback and comments below. Subscribe to my channel and I hope to see you in my next videos. Bye.